Good morning, traders, and welcome to the Daily Call today, Friday, the 10th of November. All right, taking a quick look at yesterday's uh, data from yesterday's session, we had from the US uh, the unemployment claims number. It was the only solitary bit of data that came out yesterday. That came on pretty much close to forecast on 217,000 uh, claims. Um, overall, not a whole lot of movement yesterday. The US dollar did um, have its way against the major. Uh, but not by a whole lot. So this morning, let's just uh, jump into our chart of the day and uh, see what we have there. The chart that I'm looking at this morning is the Euro AUD on a daily time scale. Now, if you have a look at this uh, particular chart, I've already marked out a zone of or a level of resistance. I should say we are approaching or first of all we've rejected off this level on two occasions already and we are approaching it right now for a third time and the question remains will it reject it one more time so what i'd like to see is evidence that the market is reversing in this highlighted area what i call the hot zone and if i do get evidence of reversal in the way of price action candle patterns uh, like an inside candle and a golfing candle or a shooting star or something along those lines then i'll be happy to become a seller on this market so for now i need to wait probably about at least another two candles to see what plays out and then I'll be in a position to see if we can uh, become a seller on this particular market. So for now, let's put this one in our watch list. It's the Euro AUD and that is the chart of the day for us this morning. All right, what do we have on the agenda for the session which is about to kick off? We have at 6 p.m. this evening, that's Sydney time, from the UK, we have the GDP number due out and then the only other bit of data due happens at 2 o'clock in the morning our time and it's from the US, it's the preliminary UOM consumer sentiment number which is due out. That pretty much wraps up for this morning guys as always please feel free to contact us if you do have any questions. You can also follow me on Twitter at chatfx for trade setups and breaking news. Most importantly hope you all have a fantastic trading day, have a great weekend and I'll speak to you on Monday for the daily call. Bye for now.